subscribe and ring the bell to never miss an update. It's our last stop on the Triple Thrift Holiday Edition at Still Good Consignments, located in North Houston off of Luetta Road. They have monthly online auctions, lots of great items in this very unique consignment showroom. And you can also consign your items as well. Come on in and let's take a look and see what they have for the holidays. Still Good Consignments has over 14,000 square feet and the store is filled with furniture, collectibles, art, home decor, jewelry, and even designer handbags. And they have an online presence. They do not ship, but you can actually shop and pay for it and pick it up. And we're focusing on holiday today and tabletop essentials to add to your holiday decor and table settings. These are some interesting utensils kind of has a Western look to it. And you always look at the price because it goes down the longer it's been in the store. This set of four rose bowls, they look almost like they could be votives. You could fill them with candles. It's a great find. And the creamer and sugar looks to be an Irish crystal. And that would be a great gift. And you can use that sugar bowl for candy. It doesn't have to just be for the intended purpose. Love that set. And the cloches, you know, I have featured a DIY on how to make your own cloche, and that would be great to feature a holiday item inside, even a small nativity set, and maybe a floral or something to really um, get in the holiday spirit. You could have fun with that. This Imperial Candlewick cake stand, I did preview online. I thought about buying it, but I actually have it at home, so I'll pass on that. This divided dish is great too, and the price is right. The creamer and sugar is also nice. I just have so many that I think I'll pass on that and let someone else benefit from it. And this is quite an extensive collection that they have here from Imperial. And love the candle wick design. Here's a nice cut crystal trifle bowl that could even be a centerpiece on your holiday table. You could even fill it with ornaments, maybe all red ball ornaments and make a statement. And look at that, it's gone down to $22.40. You can't beat that. They've got some beautiful crystal vases. That looks to be a European cut crystal. And you know, pitchers are so practical and purposeful. I featured an episode on these. And this is Oneida. Isn't that a great piece? The cut crystal pitcher would be the perfect gift. And that's a jigger that could go in your wet bar good men's gift as well. And here's another picture from Denby. That's an English pottery company. I actually didn't know that they offered lead crystal pieces. And now let's go into their holiday section. They do have items throughout the store, but here is uh, one of the coveted items that my friend saw online that she's getting today. It's a large pyramida. And those are powered by the candles. It's such a great piece, $126. It comes with the box. Look at all the hand carving. And this one is made in Germany. Sometimes you find the ones made in China that are not quite as good. And this is not from the Altskabilga, but it's from Bavaria. Actually, Hessen. Oba Bayern. And here's another Pyramide. And I like this one because it not only is new in a box, it's $40. These go for over $200 online. But they fit tea light candles. And I like that because those are more affordable to buy for replacement candles than the German ones. And there's a nutcracker hiding in the back. That crackle vase would be nice too. You could put a candle in that for centerpiece. I like this little nutcracker. He could even sit in a candy dish. So many possibilities. And I think that is a Steinbach, which means it's going to be more expensive. This is a nice nativity that kind of has a more of a modern twist. I like that. And the Lionel train conductor, I think that was made by the Kurt Adler company. And look at all that detailing, even with his lantern in the coal. 
That's a great piece. That won't stay there for long. And the price is right. And these are some nice neutral items you could add to your holiday. Or if you're getting a gift for someone, you could make sure to find something that would go with their decor. And I'm seeing some nutcrackers, but what I'm focusing on is the smoker. And that's a Reusch I mentioned. It's a Steinbach, which is a really great brand. And it says music box. We'll have to see about that. And I like that for my family, at least it ties in with some of my children and things that they used to like to do, collect mushrooms in the forest in Germany. And of course they are German and we do collect the smokers. So this might be a really great gift for one of my kids. I think I will take this one home today. It's just too perfect. It practically has my name on it. Still Good Consignments has a wonderful Christmas section with other holiday items throughout the store. This is my favorite find of the day so far. It's a Steinbach, which is the premier wood maker for all the Christmas decor in Germany. And this is a smoker. You lift the top and you put a cone-shaped incense here and the smoke comes out of his pipe. It's really fun. This is the mushroom seller. You see he's got a beautiful basket here sitting on a mushroom and it's musical. It plays Edelweiss. See the Tyrolean hat? He is definitely coming home with me. And they have lots of nutcrackers. I wanted to point out a few to you. And they start the price at half of retail. This is a, a Christian Ulbricht. It's $94, which is half of retail. And the longer it's here, the better the price is. I like the natural colors here too. And this one is actually a signed Christian Ulbricht from the Altsgebirge. And it looks like he's the toy maker. He's got the original tags on him and he is a nutcracker. And here are some stocking hangers that you can put on the mantle. Those are nice and whimsical. And they do have designer ribbon as well. These measuring spoons, I think those are made by Gans. And for $8, that would be a great hostess gift or stocking stuffer. I think that that is a perfect gift. And here are some coasters with a holiday theme. Again, new in a box, great for gifting. I like this angel candle holder. Wouldn't she be great in the center of a table or an entryway? Or perhaps if you're serving a buffet, she could grace your table. And she's white and neutral, which would go with any dishes that you have. I like that doormat, jingle all the way. Yes, please. And this Santa with reindeer, I love that. These are candle holders. I have a nativity set that reminds me of this. This is made in China. I love the look and this vase that almost looks like Vietri. I'm not sure if it is. And it's a very good price. Again, you know, fill that with some evergreens, bring it as a gift. And the Spode Christmas, that is one of the most collectible holiday patterns. And you've seen this in the Bluebird Circle. Here's a soap dish. And if you remember the Eagleville, Tennessee shop, I found an English soap dish and shared some tips on what you can do with that for your table. I like the colors on this with the Christmas lights. Could really add some interest to your white dishes. And lots of snowmen. I think that I really need to step up my game because I don't tend to focus on that, but that is a very popular winter decor item. And this is the Victorian Christmas by Johnson Brothers. My friend bought an entire set for about $35 at our neighborhood goodwill last year and it's funny because i had just been in the store two hours prior and they did not put it out at that point and she sent me a picture and said look what i got i couldn't believe it i was so happy for her this is the villa Bach design naive which is perfect for winter we have some spice jars that are home in germany that i actually found at goodwill here in houston mr and mrs claus oh those are fun i like the size of these two it really makes a great statement and I'm glad they sell it as a pair. Wouldn't want to break them up. And the Fleur de Lis is a very popular design, especially here in Texas. We're close to Louisiana. And you have a pair of prints and they're brand new. Look at that. You could easily gift that to someone or add it to your holiday decor. And speaking of that, just adding one or two dishes would really add some interest to your table or even if you have a neighbor that drops by and you offer them some hot chocolate you could pull this out have some cookies or something fun on it and i see some great decor items that angel looks to be a tree topper but she could actually be on an entry table 
I like those colors. And remember the price goes down the longer it's there. That's a lovely wreath for your front door and it's ready to go. And wreaths can be very expensive, so I think that price is right. And they have some very high-end florals for holiday decor and garlands. That looks like it's lit. And the pair of topiaries here, I think was the deal of the century. I don't know why I didn't buy them. Maybe I don't need them. I didn't realize it's the pair. What a good price. And if you have a very neutral look for your holiday decor, these silver trees would be fun. And that kind of fits a farmhouse look right there. And that is definitely very popular. Here's some more items that would look great with that style. And I like that two-tiered server. That's wonderful for Christmas cookies, small bites. And these are nice accent pieces you could add next to a lamp in a living room, entry table. And of course, we're all counting the number of days till Christmas. And again, some more farmhouse items. They're very neutral. It would go just about anywhere. I like that snowman. And here's a ready-made bouquet. That's nice for the winter. You could actually keep it out a little bit longer than just Christmas. And that would be fun to hang up. You could actually remove some of the art you have in your home and replace it just for the season. And don't forget about furniture. Maybe you're looking to make a change in a room and that could be a family gift that you decide you want to add a new. And that's another beautiful topiary. I like that they often have a pair of them and so many wreaths. Look at that. You could even add ornaments and embellish it. And let's take a look around the store now and look at all these beautiful cups from Linux. This is the Holiday Nouveau and it's platinum instead of the gold rim. That is something that you don't see very often. And wouldn't that be beautiful to serve hot chocolate in? They have lots of different Christmas patterns and all different price points. I like that holly. Oh, that definitely would add to your table for a festive look. And if you know someone has plenty of storage, you could actually gift them with a set of dishes. This is the Spode Christmas, the double of fashions. That would look great with just plain white or red plates. This is Castleton. You can tell by the edging. It is exquisite. This pattern I just absolutely adore. The price has gone down to about 700. And this reminds me of times gone by, the Castleton Rose pattern. And look, there's Marilyn Monroe, a touch of pop art here today. It's still good consignments. And you have to really look up and around. There's a lot you could miss. These I saw online as well. It's the Linux holiday trivets that are expandable. And I think they have the boxes. And look at this pair of topiaries. I'm definitely getting these today. I saw them online, but wasn't sure about the scale. And I think that's a fair price for the pair and you don't have to add a thing to it. I don't know if you can tell, but it glistens as well. There's some gold and those red chargers are fabulous. And red goes with so many seasons, Valentine's Day, 4th of July. You could even serve some strawberry dessert. Look at that picture. That is beautiful. And these Spode Hurricanes, of course, the Spode logo comes off. I've not seen these before. I think that's a really good price. I wanted you to get a good look at these topiaries to see the scale. I'm so happy with them. And my family in Franklin, Tennessee found this same sleigh at a Goodwill store and I'll hopefully feature that before Christmas. And that's a really good price. So many possibilities with that. They're going to add white deer to theirs. And this pattern from Fitz and Floyd is one that I have not seen before and I fell in love with it. And the price has gone down to now looks like 280. It's gorgeous, but I have two patterns already and I don't want to have to store another one, but the Christmas Holly definitely makes the top of my list. And it's quite a comprehensive collection that they have here, even with a large platter. And wouldn't these sherbets look great with that? You could set that on top of a dessert plate and have a chocolate mousse or perhaps an appetizer. And here's some of that much loved Spode Christmas. And you have to look throughout the store because I think they had some more. 
so you could buy two different lots and the dishes go on for miles they have walls of them but i wanted to show you some of the dining tables as well there's a desk there's something for everyone every style and size and they have great centerpieces too and lots of decorative elements you know they do have a lot of antique dealers that shop here and house flippers people come from other states to shop at still good consignments and they've got lots of the water for crystal holiday heirloom ornaments look at that nativity set they try to start the price out at half of retail and then it, of course it goes down the longer it's been there so they're starting that at 50 dollars for the holy family i think that's a steal and i'm sure that will not last long and there's a santa i don't know that waterford makes the heirloom ornaments anymore and i had not seen this victorian shoe before that's definitely something different the angel is sweet and look they're new in boxes wouldn't that make a great gift and speaking of that i think the pair of candle holders here with the box from waterford crystal oh even the retail prices from the 1990s when i worked for them they were much higher and this bowl i couldn't believe it's a master cutter piece from waterford crystal it's exquisite and i just did not expect to find this today I think that might have to come home with me. And the blue willow is classic and I think goes very well with holiday. You can add some red to it and it must have a really great back stamp. Speaking of back stamps, here is the Waterford Bowl. They call it a cutter's special, which in my day with Waterford would have been a master cutter piece that is worked on and designed by some of their top artisans. Here's another Waterford Crystal Bowl that takes me back to the 90s. And look, that one has the original box too. And the retail would have been a whole lot more. I think I would have handled this bowl many times. Remember, consignment stores are great places for holiday gifts. I found this Water for Crystal Aragon Bowl. This is a retired piece. It's gone down to $63. Amazing. This would be probably 200 or more retail. It's absolutely exquisite. I might take that one home. And it's featured here with the Kildare pattern, you probably have seen this. We featured this at the Bluebird Circle. And this is a special master cutter piece that has gone down in price. It was originally 600, at least retail, and it has now gone down to $236. Isn't that a masterpiece? Absolutely gorgeous. And there's some candle holders here that have gone down to pretty good price as well. This is the Lismore pattern. And the pair of candle holders is now $38.50. And a lot of these items have the original box. Where can you go in town and get such a luxurious gift for under $50? Marquee by Waterford Brookside Double Old Fashions. You really don't often find in the red. That's cased crystal. So it is crystal that has been dipped in the color. And those would be great on a holiday table. And here they've got anything from Waterford crystal to Baccarat and Orifers, which is a Swedish crystal and that vase in the center is baccarat and the prices are truly amazing look at that orifers bowl for 21 dollars. actually i think it's gone down some more these would make great gifts even if they don't have the original box this i think is a tiffany bowl my friend found a similar one at goodwill it's definitely their iconic look for 63 dollars. it's beautiful and these are the cordials, Lismore, Waterford, and those cost as much as the goblets because it's the same amount of work. 14 hours of labor goes into each glass. That's a beautiful pair of Waterford candle holders. This, I believe, was part of the Grafton collection. They made for a short while. It's definitely a different look. And that picture from Waterford, I've not seen. I think it must be from the 80s, and it is gorgeous. It's a nice size, too. And that one's gone down in price. Swarovski... Those are highly collectible figurines made in Austria. And look, there's a nutcracker. It would be a great Christmas gift. And I bet that some of these have the original boxes. You know, I love the Linux holiday. And they even have some of the Nouveau with a more modern look. Those are sleighs. You could balance those. They have two of them and put them on a table and maybe candles in the center in these two small terrines are lovely i like that bell dish that's a large bowl and it's something that kind of looks a little retro inside and for 16 dollars, i may have to think about that 
have some pieces I haven't seen before. This is a dipping sauce set where you fill it with oil and then you have your four tasting plates for $20. It's a good deal. These are also Linux and they're snowmen and those can be used as bases. And the candle holders, it's nice that they have a pair and I think that's an older piece. I have not seen that and it's actually sold as a pair. This is the winter pattern from Linux, winter greetings that would go with probably all the way through early February. I like that. It's a little more versatile than the holiday. And you know we're all about royal collectibles. I featured an episode on that with my collection. And these are beautiful to commemorate the births of Prince George and Princess Charlotte. I wonder if someone went over to England. Maybe they bought these at Harrods. Those are fabulous. And they come with the boxes. That's quite a find. I don't even know if you can get this online. And the classic Wedgwood Jasperware. They have a nice variety here and the price is right. I don't know if you've ever priced it retail, but a box like this would easily be 100, 125. And look, it's $14. That is amazing. I have a large collection, so I'm probably not gonna add more. And this color combination you don't see as often. And look, it's only $20. Wow. And here's another smoker, or I like to call them smoky men, Roche I mentioned, and that is also a Steinbach. And Santa on his sleigh filled with toys, nothing can get you in the holiday spirit like that. It's a little out of my budget, so I think I will have to pass on that, but I really do like him. He sure would be a great addition to my collection. And I love Chinoiserie, look at that. That's a small version of one of those stools that you see and again goes well with Christmas you just might see that on my table and this pair of bowls is from Rosenthal which is a German company that make china and crystal it's nice that you have two because you could balance that out on a table and look at that the price has gone down to twenty dollars a bowl can you imagine just fill that with some fruit bring it to your friend for a special gift or just simply find a nice gift box. Oh, look at all that chinoiserie. I purchased so much for my birthday. Of course, that was the design element that I featured and I have quite a lot of it. So I have to be really choosy now because of space. And these little square plates I had not seen before. They're actually from Johnson Brothers. Who knew? I didn't know that they made the square perfect for dessert. And these look to be Jim Shore, which is highly collectible. And I think that they have the boxes as well. They always list that on a tag. Again, a great gift. You don't need to have the original box for that, but it's an added bonus. This bleak heart dish is really neat. I ended up calling a friend later, telling her about that. And she went online and ordered that, paid for it. And I picked it up. They have a nice collection of Sabino glass, which is French. Look at that opalescent design and Yadro. I was surprised that they had so many and the prices are amazing and these will not last long. I actually sold these polar bears to the chairman of Coca-Cola. That was one of my corporate clients for years in my corporate gift business. I like the lady with the parasol. It's a delicate piece. And here near the register, they have Halcyon Days boxes, Swarovski. I bought some of my Limoges boxes here with my Christmas collection in this very store in that vitrine. And those lovebirds from Baccarat are nice. I bought them in clear at the Bluebird Circle and that price has gone down to, I think about $80. And that sells for probably 300 or more online, brand new in a box. So that is a steal. And you always have to look up when you come to Still Good Consignments, they have lighting wear, artwork, so many things that you'll miss. What a wonderful shopping experience this was today at Still Good Consignments. Thanks so much for joining me on the Triple Thrift Holiday Edition. As you can see, I have lots of gifts for under my tree. Waterford Crystal and some neat German items that I did not have to fly over to Germany to get and bring back in my suitcase. This is definitely going to make my Christmas extra special. And I found some holiday decor as well. Thanks again for joining Lady Mary Bab. Elevate your everyday with thrift shopping. I wish you a Merry Christmas and a Happy Holidays.